Hi, my name is Barry Crampton. Today I'm going to show you around our Ford Transit, then I'll take you for a ride in it. But first I'll tell you a little bit more about it. It's a Transit Custom 2 litre 300 Eco Blue Limited L2H1. It's got the EU6 engine as well. 2018 on an 18 plate, long wheel base, has done 18,382 miles. The documented service history on the 14th of the 5th, 2019, at 7,762 miles. It uh, was serviced at GJ Honeywell at Chelmsford, and on the 9th of the 10th, 2020, at 15,754 miles, it was serviced at GJ Honeywell Chelmsford again. Lovely spec vehicle. It has front parking sensors, multi-spoke alloy wheels, power folding door mirrors, side loading door, barn doors at the back, they open to 180 degrees to make uh, it easier to load and reverse up to a, a loading bay or get a forklift truck up to the back of the vehicle. It's got a heavy duty load liner and uh, side protective mouldings in the body colour. Uh, lo lovely colour, great spec. Okay so I'll, I'll just take you uh, for a ride in it. Those are the Ford keys. Um, I will tell you it's also got the um, extra security locks. It's had the driver's door lock taken out and uh, a blanking plate put over it, a proper blanking plate. They uh, just trying to think of a polite word. <laughs> Van thieves. We'll go. Yeah, we'll we'll go with van thieves. Um, obviously, Transit's most popular van, and it's uh, quite a sought-after vehicle. So, if you don't buy this one and you do get one, make sure you get the security locks. Um, it's uh, it, it, it's quite ridiculous, really. They they all go on about the these locks and the keys and so on, but if you pull the lock out, it's just a flipping piece of wire. And you, you, you know, you just open the door. So th that's that's the main thing to do. Right. Well, I'll take you for riding it. I'll just show you the the system here, the audio system. It's um, there. You go. You've got your your sources. It's Bluetooth hands free. Um, Bluetooth audio streaming. If I click on audio there and on sources, that's my phone there. So I can play anything, uh, any music from my phone. The moment it's playing an audio book. Um, but the the best way, and and again, fair play to to Ford. They they've offered this system with a screen, um, the Apple CarPlay interface. So you plug into your phone. You've got to download Apple CarPlay to your your phone, and as you can see there, that's gone straight onto CarPlay. It's gone straight onto my iTunes. But the, the most important thing is, rather than having to pay a fortune, or in some cases, I think in Audi, you've probably got to pay another 450 quid for the little box to, to plug in to the MMI system. Uh, Mercedes, 250 quid. With, with this, once it's plugged into Apple CarPlay, then you click on that, and it just uses your phone's sat-nav. And you can, you can operate your phone's sat-nav uh, with, with Siri. Um, and it's got all the rest of you, every, virtually everything you've got on your phone. You just say phone, you messages, you can send messages. Uh, it's even got WhatsApp, uh, Amazon Music. Well, these are things I've downloaded and I use Spotify, Amazon Music, Audible, um, audio books. So that's a, that's a, a really really good system. As I say, we'll, we'll just put it back on there so you can see uh, where I'm going. Knock that off. I, I don't want to do that. We'll, we'll just there. We go. We'll, we'll just use it as a screen for the moment and uh, go for a ride. So I, I, I really like these vans. This would make an ideal um, camper van conversion. I would say it's a good colour. It's it's, <laughs> it's kind of. I was going to say like the Audi denim blue metallic, but it's, it's perhaps a little bit darker than that. Of course, if I'd have had any, any sense, I would have found out the name before we came out. Nice big wipers, a 
quick clear front screen or heated front screen it's just a good specification there you go you've got power folding door mirrors you just put them back and they drive so good transit van first came out even back then they were so good that um, in uh, in my day my early days the, the Sweeney and so on the uh, getaway car of choice was a, a Jaguar um, 3.4 or something like that and then the thieves stopped using them and they started using transit vans because they could get more swag in them. And <laughs> they, they drove so good and handled so well. Thanks for indicating. Thank you very much. Because, yeah, and you, yeah, I, I just want to sit here all day. say the, the handling of them is just tremendous the guy's got a baseball cap on he pulls out doesn't indicate turns off but the cap excuses him <laughs> I'm in a shocking mood today we've sold my Range Rover <laughs> This is just the weather you want on. So dead comfy, we've got here. There we go, just ratchet it up, get myself comfortable. It's warm today, get the air con on. So front central armrest, this, uh, the driver's seat moves backwards and forwards, up and down as well. In fact, I could just do with going down a bit, there we go. So that's knocking it down. Can I get rake it back a little bit I'll bet, I bet I've just uh, I've just adjusted that camera as well because it's fastened to the back of the seat <laughs> lots of um, cup holders behind us and boo that one it goes past Whew. it's uh, it's absolutely boiling in here that's all my camera gear there by the way so it may look a, a little bit messy but um, in all honesty the, the, the back in here is a bit dusty and I didn't want to put my bag and my coat in there so I've packed them into the front cabin I always drive these too fast but they're so good full bulkhead here so none of the problems like you used to have with old vans where you got all the noise um, coming from whatever you were carrying all the smells too which was sometimes the worst thing and also if you had to pull up quickly anything was in the back ended up on you
place to break down. I bet he's, I bet he's not broken down. I bet he's, I mean, on Facebook or something. Also got cruise control here switch on like so click down we're just doing 60 at the moment but I can increase the speed here with this button by just pressing up there we go we'll click it up to 70 there we go 70 miles an hour and now we're stuck behind there and we'll try the sat nav again it, it is quite easy it, it never recognizes my voice I don't know why hey Siri navigate to Grosvenor garage Preston which Preston Preston lock lock Preston Karch and Preston all music matters Siri are you stupid I'm just trying to do my job if there's anything else I can help you with, just let me know. So we're just doing short of 70 there in six gear. About 1750 revs. 70 will be about 18. Pretty quiet. So it would make an ideal camper van. Uh, if you look at the, the windscreen, Lance have, has washed this with some stuff that's meant to keep your vehicle cleaner. And it's it's working so well, it's throwing it down. I haven't even got the wipers on and the and the water is just coming off. And it's on it's the same as all the car too. It's it's I must find out what it is, but it's a brilliant job. Great seating position too, pretty economical, nicely finished, got this kind of piano black on the doors and the dash, um, I don't really like these iPad displays myself, if you'd overtaken as many vans as I have with three people in and one of them's got their feet up on the dashboard in the middle there. thousand miles so I can't see there being anything wrong with the suspension but I always like to check it just here anyway no it's fine It's a really nice van. Only just come in. Great colour combination. The cab's nice and tidy, which is most important if you're uh, looking to convert it to a camper van. Vans have been well. All, we've we've had the busiest week ever. Um, stock is fairly hard to find. 
but uh, John's doing his best so I don't expect this will be here very long when we stop I'll show you how to pair a mobile how to delete a mobile um, how to stream audio and uh, how to use the Apple CarPlay and uh, in the meantime next video again hopefully we just had the wheels done on it we just got it back um, an Audi QS5 um, got a little Toyota Verso um, gosh what else and hopefully uh, a couple of Range Rovers come in and uh, see you in the next video thanks for watching